Welcome everybody to another YouTube video. Um, this time today I'm going to do um, like my recent pickups that I've had that I haven't done unboxings or I haven't really talked about. So I kind of wanted just to share um, those things with you guys today. So we're gonna get right into the video. Um, let me show you guys what I've gotten so far. All right, so recently I picked up just a hoodie um because it was $34.99 and then it had a 50% discount then added my discount onto that and it came out came out to be about eleven twelve dollars I believe it's just a plain um gray hoodie which I do not need right now but who knows in the future if I will need it so it's always nice to have plus to lounge around inside the house where it's nice and cold um, it's great for that so I had to definitely pick that up for the cheap price that it was um, and then another pickup is going to be this USA t-shirt USA t-shirt right here um, it was $12.99 and then I believe it had a 30% and then um, another 30% on top of that so it came out to be about six or seven dollars, which you know you can't beat. It's red, which was the team colors um, that we wore. So I could have wore this, but I think we might be changing colors now. But it's still a great T-shirt to have, especially with Fourth of July coming up, and of course the Women's World Cup, which I'm excited to watch and see how that comes out. Hopefully they can win it again, bring home the the trophy once again. So yeah, cheap shirt, and this one was at the clearance store actually. So those of you, if you're from, if you watch and you're from the Orlando area um, or Florida area, and you want to drive, um, there was a clearance store that closed down, and it opened back up in the area. You know, if you're familiar with the area, it's called the Loop, um, and it's way bigger. Um, so definitely, you can go find some steals there. This is the only thing that I have from that store, but definitely um, worth going to check out of course because there's just a lot of deals and it's huge now so they have way much more inventory and it's just way much better so definitely if you're from the area go check it out uh, my, ne my next pickup not anything too special just um, I have these uh, Adidas shin guards that I saw um, let me tell you why I see I have I have way too many shin guards a lot but the reason that I have, I, bought, I got these ones was because, as you can see, they're size small. And um, the reason I got them was because of the fit, the way they um, looked. So, look at, um, they are small, but wide. Most shin guards that you get, um, they're just um, small. And although I do like that, they don't really fit obviously on my shin very well. Um, and these ones are like, you know, stretched out as you can see. So that really is beneficial for me and exactly what I need. So this is like the perfect shin guard for me. Small, but spreads out. I have to, um, if you know, the J guard is what I use. And I had to put them under something heavy to you know kind of flatten them out but these are just wide and, and just perfect it's just too bad that it's that brand right there that we won't talk about we won't say but yeah other than that um these are my favorite shin guards and i'm gonna start using them can't use them yet because we're not in season um but we're done but soon soon get back to playing uh and my next pickup that i got um was just this Headband, I also got a black one, but I can't find it right now because I think I actually used it and um, I probably washed it or something. I don't know where it's at. Um, and then, I, so this, I, like I said, is for the team colors that we had red. I think we're switching uh, colors. I don't know why, but you know, I was supposed to wear this and it just kind of keeps the sweat out of the eyes. And if, you know, I got these and then as soon as I, um, was going to start wearing these i noticed that neymar started wearing them and then i actually looked on the website for nike and they sold out i had to get this from dick sporting goods 
with no discount. Meh. But my black one, the black one that I have is just black with the white swoosh. I did get that for um, with my discount, so that's good. But this is, uh, I couldn't use my discount for this. But Neymar, I guess, started a trend and now they're sold out of a few different colors. So, but yeah, just want to say that I thought about wearing it first before he did. So, whatever. Um, and then my next pickup. Uh, my next pickup, I already wore these once, but they're just these um, Superfly Elites. Uh, if you saw one of my uh, videos, uh, my Nutmeg videos, I already had these in there. Um, and the reason I'm showing them was because these hit my store at a price of $59.99. And now, if you know, these are $275 shoes, and I got them for $59.99 which is a huge steal plus my discount 30%. Um, and you know, you can't, I can't pass up vapors or superflies that come in the store for that price. So just saying. All right, and my next pickup, of course, another soccer shoe. The majority of these are going to be soccer shoes and it is the Superfly Elite in this colorway. Um, I haven't worn these yet. Uh, but these were about $60 as well. So I'm telling you guys, if you guys want higher end cleats, you know, you can search for them. You can find them. Definitely will find them. You just got to do clearing stores. You got to go to the factory stores and, you know, you definitely will be able to find them. And this colorway, it didn't intrigue me at first, but, you know, it's just another shoe to add to the collection, as you can see behind me. Um, so yeah, it was just something that I just wanted just because, cause this colorway, I won't care about getting dirty and I'll wear it. I don't, not looking at it. It's, it, I don't even think it's a red, maybe right here. I don't know if you can see that, but maybe not the camera, but it's almost like a orange. Let's, let's look at the box. Um, wolf gray and crimson. And if you know, my favorite animal is a wolf. So wolf gray is definitely the color to, to have. All right, and continuing the soccer shoe that we have, we got another some Fly Elite. Yes, I do buy these. I do collect a ton of them. It's a very, it's a, for me to me the new uh, Vapor Twelve and the Superfly Six Elite are just very comfortable shoes. And this time we have this one. I do have the Vapor version of this, um, so having the Superfly Elite is kind of cool too. Um, you got this. I don't know what this was made for. It kind of was reminiscent to the Neymar cleat. Um, a little bit um, and this one did the stream bag the other one did not I don't know why they probably lost it at the Nike store but who cares I don't care about it. I got too many already um, but this came into our store at a $59.99 price tag and of course I had to apply my discount and got them for very cheap and like I said I don't pass up on um, superflies or vapors no matter what if I have the vapor version and the Superflies come in, I'm going to get them. If I have the Superfly version and the Vapors come in, I'm going to get them. Um, so, like I'm telling you guys, if you guys want, you know, quality cleats and don't want to spend the money, just hold off a little bit. There's nothing wrong with having, you know, an older model or, or color or something like that. Like, you're getting something high-end um, for a very cheap price. And, I mean, that's, to me, that's a win-win situation no matter what. Uh, just in my opinion. All right, and um, another item that I have, I'm going to open this up because I've had this actually, I'm not going to lie, I've had this sitting around for a while. I just haven't got to um, using it, um, but I have, it's basically, um, if you can tell what this is, this is a band for it, and this is a screen protector, and then this is like a little bumper, and it's the... Uh, series 4 Apple Watch. I haven't opened it, um, but I should. I should be using it because I still have, this is actually the first one and it's worked fine as long as my phone is in my pocket or close to me. Battery lasts pretty much all day at moderate use or, or even using it. So, but I mean, interesting story. Like I said, one time the screen had popped off of this one. Maybe it was the issue with the, the battery that swelled up maybe and pushed the screen off. And that I went and bought this one because of that reason. 
um, and you know I've had it for a few months already which I should have opened it and start using it because probably the series 5 is going to be coming out and um, I pff, this one's going to be old um, but so I took a little bit of um, I think Gorilla Glue and just put like a dot a dot right here and a dot right there and um, it worked um, I let it dry for a little bit and you know it works pretty good works fine no issues there so if that happens to you don't freak out don't panic you don't have to go to Apple you don't have to do a claim or anything it was a horror story going through Apple with my phone with with the watch everything so you know do yourself a favor do some research try to do stuff if you can if you can fix it on your own you know give that a shot um, but yeah so series 4 watch that I need to open because actually I do have a band this I don't really need because I have a band that my mom purchased me for me it's a like a piano keys and it looks really cool so I'm excited to throw that on this watch because if you know my first love is music and my real love is music and then you know sports is a, a I wouldn't say close second but second place so music is my important thing my most important thing and that it's a it's just a piano keyboard whatever you want to call it um band that's leather it's pretty cool so maybe in the future in videos you'll be seeing me wearing that and not this one with the new watch all right and my last pickup um this time is going to be these you know you if you're a jordan fan you know what box this is um i know i do a lot of soccer reviews um, shoes but mostly because um, I feel like there's too many out there who do you know basketball shoes or or Jordans and stuff like that so I mean people don't really watch my I don't think so I don't think people really watch my content for for that stuff I think you know they like the soccer shoes better if I'm not mistaken so I don't really do reviews on, on this stuff anymore I might in the future again but you know we got a size 10 and a half as you can see you know what it is, Jordan 1, but in the crimson tint. And this shoe to me is awesome. I don't know, I love it. If you ask me, I just think that's such a clean colorway. And the leather is good quality, really good quality. Um, so that's a huge plus and um, it comes with green laces as well, which I don't know if I'll put on, but yeah. Um, this shoe, actually, it's like sold out in most places, but I happened to go to um, a champ store, uh, interesting enough, at this very tiny mall here in Orlando, and I stumbled across this mall because I was headed to a soccer game and I needed to go to the bathroom so I stopped at this mall and um, went inside looked around for a little bit I had some time to kill and I went to Champ Sports and they had this shoe sitting there and I asked them if they had a ten and a half they did and this sold out everywhere that I remember I could so this I couldn't get a discount on this but so after I kept going for like two or three weeks and um, seeing if it um, was still available and it was and then they ended up going to um, the the Florida Mall and just get them there because they had them there. I don't I don't know how they had a few pairs still. So um, I one thing I do know is I have to wear them. I have to wear all my shoes. I have so many shoes back here that I haven't even um, touched, and it I I really need to do that. I need to start wearing them. And, uh, so no more shoes until I wear them that's you know even with my soccer shoes I want to start I just want to wear them all and if I get them dirty I get them dirty of course I would try to clean them but you know I just want to start wearing all my sneakers and all my soccer shoes because why why buy them if they're just gonna sit there you know s shout out to the person who left a comment on my um, the white and gold mercurials and he told me wear them get them dirty like shout out to you if you're watching this video um, you kind of inspired me just to go through and and you know they're just shoes you know yeah we might pay a lot for them but that's the whole point right you get them to wear them so um hopefully 
I'm gonna start putting every sneaker in my rotation and all my soccer shoes as well. So that's my video for today. Thanks for watching. Those were my pickups. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.